The city of Henderson told residents in one HOA community to fix their leaking pipes or the water would be turned off and they'd be forced to leave in two weeks. And that was two weeks ago today. What will happen now to the Somerset Park townhome? Sir Kim Passoff has been following this since the beginning. She's back in the community near Pubco and Sunset tonight with the latest on what will happen. Yeah, so those issues we first told you about two weeks ago have not been fixed. We drove around the community tonight and there are leaks everywhere, including this one right here. This one is so bad that it actually caused a sinkhole to open up. That is what those barricades are for, so drivers don't go over it. Now the city of Henderson will be coming in to fix it all and the homeowners will have to pay for it. A total turmoil. That is how Irene Montano describes the last two weeks. Since all homeowners here got a letter on their front door from the city of Henderson, the water continues to run from the pipes and into the gutters at Somerset Park. No repairs have been made. Residents say that their current HOA management company got estimates to the tune of $1 million plus to patch the problems, but the city wants all the pipes replaced and they will come in and get the job done after the HOA failed to propose a viable solution. Oh, I'm actually living. For the 85 homeowners, that means tax liens on their properties and a bill of about $7,000 each. And at a Monday night meeting, they were told their HOA fees are also going up to fix the dried out landscaping. Now, $412 a month. In the overall scheme of things, it puts a strain. I'm very frustrated. On my way home, I literally cried the whole way. Kendra Day, a mom of six, says she can't afford all the new monthly charges and is now considering moving out. We're looking at around, I'm gonna say about probably 700 to $800 a month on top of my mortgage, um, which is insane. It's not fair. I just feel like this is the worst of the worst situation that could happen. And we reached out to the city tonight. They say they are now awaiting a formal proposal from the HOA. But again, as the mayor said during a press conference last week, as long as there is some sort of plan in place, no one will be forced to leave their homes tomorrow. Reporting live tonight, Kim Passoff, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. Tomorrow, the HOA management company will meet with the city to present a budget. No timeline for the work to begin yet, but the city says they want to get the wasted water stopped as soon as possible.